Welcome to the first set of videos that are designed to teach various BPMN modeling concepts. Let's open up our Microsoft Visio file, and we will select a new file and select a BPN diagram. We'll go ahead and create our file and now start by building our basic process. We'll do so by using start event, sequence flows, and activities. In this case, we've identified three tasks for our process. As you'll notice, I'm playing with various features in Microsoft Visio. Sometimes it makes it easier when modeling, and other times it can be quite clunky. So now I'm done playing with a few of the auto-build features. And I'll finish my basic business process flow. Here I'm just describing the three activities that we do in our basic process. Our process begins when the start event is triggered. The first step in our process, we develop training material. We use sequence flow to connect the next action in our process, which is conduct training. After we conduct training, we evaluate student progress. And then we use an end event to signify that our process for training is over. Microsoft Visio allows you to align and reposition your shapes. This can be handy when building and making clean models for Microsoft Visio. For those of you who are new to Microsoft Visio, Microsoft Visio allows you to change the tasks or event types by right-clicking on the object. As we drive into various notions, we highlight these different event and task types. And there you have it, our basic process model. That is it. Thank you for joining us on our first video, and we look forward to engaging with you in future videos.